All right, hey guys, this is Brian again. I wanted to show you the uh, backyard raised garden beds we've got here on the deck along with the kale. You can see the kale. I haven't done an update in a while. The kale's really slowed down because as you can see, we don't get any sun back here at this time of year in October. Because the sun, basically, the line of sun goes right across those back of those trees behind there right down over there and right behind our house. So we don't get any direct sun on our garden back here anymore, except for just out there in the yard. Of course, there's one of our little bug, two of them. <laughs> I don't think they knew who I was out here in the backyard talking. <laughs> oh, they ran back in. <laughs> oh, you gotta love filming. <laughs> I'm going to leave this in because I haven't done a video update for you guys in a couple of weeks. So uh, whatever happens, happens. <laughs> All right. Anyway, the kale, it does, you know, it does get a little bit of morning sun. But uh, you can see it's really slowed down. There is some new growth down in there of some stuff that we harvested off. Uh, I think it was last weekend Paula came in here and just chopped it all off. Because uh, I've got inside the indoor grows, I've got the new uh, two trays of Vates kale starting. So I've got those started inside the, uh, the indoor grow. And then I also cleared out the, uh, the marigolds. I took those, chopped and dropped them down there to see if the seed heads will uh, break down and maybe self-propagate for next year. Uh, here's the cabbage up in here. So this is the cabbage that we had. And then there's some broccoli. Here's another broccoli. There's a couple of broccoli back here. But since they got in so late, and then the way we get our sun, you know, it's hard to have a, a fall garden in our yards because uh, once that sun disappears, man, it's just gone. I mean, it's not like most other yards where you're, I mean, we're on a north-faced hill and then we have, you know, 50 to 100 foot trees that block off the sun from the, you know, when we head into the winter solstice after, you know, the fall equinox. So we kind of lose out on uh, doing much fall gardening. And the trees are starting to shed their, uh, their leaves. So we've got a nice mess here on our deck and then we've got our uh, over here this is some of our uh, I harvested off all the uh, spaghetti squash this weekend so these are you know spaghetti squash looking and these these almost look like delicata squash but uh, we're gonna keep those try eating them what the heck and then this one here almost looks like a great griller but uh, I don't know I don't know how they would get mixed like that over there back over there in the, the back well, that's kind of the update for the, uh, the lower deck garden boxes. All right, talk to you guys again. Maybe another week, maybe two. I'm slowing down on the amount of videos I'm actually putting up because uh, I've got other projects that I'm working on on the inside and, and doing the videos and taking the time to do the editing. I can only do it during the week and then, you know, with long commute times and that kind of thing, sometimes you just get tired and you just don't want to do that kind of stuff when you get home. So I'll try and make it a little more regular, but, uh, you know, it's coming into winter. And there's uh, other projects, so maybe I'll be doing a lot more indoor projects of showing you guys what I'm working on instead of the outdoor stuff. All right, talk to you guys again. Bye.